Hey, this is Russ with Keller Williams. How is everybody? Hey, today I wanted to talk about something pretty simple. We probably heard it in various sources if you've been in business at all for a while. Uh, there's lots of top, lots of people talking about this subject, and that is leadership versus management. I had a good call today uh, with one of my coaches, and and I wanted to just kind of clarify some things Could, because often we get them mixed up. And if you expect leadership out of people that are managers, you're going to have a problem. And if you expect management out of people that are leaders, you might have a problem. So you got to kind of understand who you're working with and what expectations you have of that person before you can then hold them accountable so you're not bucking an 80 mile an hour headwind, if you know what I mean. So I'm just going to read something that I thought was pretty cool. The managers are administrators and the leaders are innovators. The manager has a short range view. The leader has a long range perspective. The manager asks how and when. The leader asks what and why. The manager has his eye on the bottom line. The leader has his eye on the horizon. The manager accepts the status quo and the leader challenges it. Therein lies the one that I think is the most important part of the delta between leadership and management. And that is a manager is trying to get the job done, trying to get caught up, trying to implement. The leader is always trying to add more, always trying to kick in more doors, always trying to scale up, always seeing what's on the, you know, on the next level of the horizon. In other words, one of the things that I often say is if I achieve my goals, I'm very disappointed because I didn't set them high enough. So what I'd like to do is challenge you. Are you a leader or are you a manager? Not right or wrong. But maybe do some research on that. I found it interesting. All right. Hope everybody has a great day. Take care.